So, hi everyone. This is the day 35. So, five weeks is, are behind us. Uh, yesterday it was a pretty interesting day because it was the weather was really nice. But on the other hand, uh, most of the people had a, a pretty hard day. Uh, even people like Sarvagata were pretty slow. Also, I, I had a pretty slow day. <coughs> Only William and uh, Stutishil were pretty were quite fast. Here we have a ray. Oh, so he's going by with a video camera. Okay, so uh, it's always interesting uh, whether uh, it's never uh, the main reason why people are slow. Sometimes it's just, uh, you know, this. All this mileage just take take a toll, and you just use up your earlier energy. It was yesterday. It was also my case. I was just slower than usually. Today is a little bit better. We will see how it will be in the evening. You never, never, you can never say. I mean, it's not a big difference in the speed. It's only like one lab or something like that. But the feel, difference is how you feel. There is always. Uh, a real difference so when I, when I feel like the, the mileage which I do usually I have to put, put much more energy into it to do the same laps so I know it's it's harder also but I think is that it's not going to be easier it's still like 900 miles to go <clears throat> so and it's going to be tough that's sure uh, the other people in those days, last days, William is uh, really, really fast, and he's doing really good, good mileage. He's really flying always. So last today I saw him in the even. Right, I think it was also yesterday. He was running from the from the beginning, really fast. Usually in the morning he used to be a little bit slower, but then in the evening he just fly by. But today he tried even in the morning to do the fast uh, laps anyway it's really good yeah. today we were talking with Ananda Lahari about the kind of madness which we are going through here he told me stories as he when he's really tired that a few times happened to him that he was he just as, as kind of hallucinations a few times he just uh, uh, tried to pick up something on the ground and he then he realized that there is nothing there <laughs> or he waved at somebody who was coming to him only to realize that there is nobody there <clears throat> so this kind of state of consciousness you are in sometimes and you are really really tired yeah in my case I when I'm really sleepy, I started to... I saw the dwarves, I call it. I have a story when I... Once when I was, a, was a, running a six-day race. It happened in the early hours in the morning. I was coming to the camp and there was a, a dwarf, dwarf looking from the side of, side of the uh, street at me. Uh, only when I came closer, I realized that it's... Uh, Actually, uh, uh, the, the, the fire hydrant. So you know these kind of things are your mind is playing with you. So these are funny things which are going your mind. You are going through, <clears throat> but they 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 can really show you how how this race is. <clears throat> it's really hard to comprehend how how tough it is. Usually. When I ask people who run this race for the first time after the race how the race was compared to how they were imagining it and usually they said that it was much tougher than they expected because it's really hard to, to understand how, how tough it is Okay, I guess that's it for today and see you tomorrow